I was at my swimming today, guys. That's why I look like this. <laughs> I was at my swimming. It was wonderful. It was so good to be at my swimming. Right, hold on. I get the chat up. Let me get the chat up. These are squinty. Look at that one that you do. The swimming was marvellous. Oh, it was so good. There's my pip. Good. Is it still morning? It's morning. Good morning, lovely pip. Good morning to you. Good morning. Yes, my swimming was open today. It was wonderful. Um, so I went up and I had a jacuzzi first. I was only in it for about five minutes because I really wanted to get in and do a swim. And then I done 40 lengths of the little pool. 40 lengths. So it was one. And then I came out and had a lovely shower and everything. So it was really good. So I feel, I feel a lot better mentally and everything. I feel good today. And my Sophie, she's excited. She's going to her little hotel place today. So look at the state of me. <laughs> What's new? Anyway, I've got unboxings to do. But first, before I get onto the makeup, I think this is new slippers that I ordered. See if it is. Then they're going on my feet immediately. Because... I've been meeting you. Yes, it is. It's my new slippers. <laughs> like you see these guys. And I've got two sets because I like to have a backup set. <laughs> Do you like my slippers? My new slippers. Good morning, Stuart. Good morning. Uh -huh. And I've got a backup pair. They go in my wardrobe. But these are going on immediately. These, these bad boys are going on right now. Get on my feet, you. Oh. <laughs> yes. There we go. Get that one on. Oh, oh, there's a party happening in my feet now. Nova, good morning to you. I'm all over the place today. Right, let's get started doing this. These are squinty. I hate that. I hate it when you say squinty. That's better now. There's my sky. My beautiful sky. Jacqueline, good morning, lovely Jacqueline. Good morning. I hope you're doing good. Nova did the same guy. Golfer girl, good morning, my lovely golfer girl. Did you see my slippers? I get two pairs because I like to have a backup pair. <laughs> good morning, Jack. Good morning. Right, I'm getting into this makeup. Um, it's in two boxes. So it should be the entire um, collection. I know, I know I'm a terrible, a problem of the Aristocats. Um, the Aristocats um, collection. Oh, oh, oh. This will be going on you on Saturday. On Saturday I'll be making these into Marie. Even if you're a gentleman, it doesn't matter. I'm going to make these into Marie from Aristocats. Oh, this thing's dropping all over the place. Okay, let's get my stuff falling everywhere. Such a professional, look at me. Right, we'll open the palette first. Oh, look at that, it's so cute. Sky, it reminds me of you because it's from La Francie. There's lovely Marie right there. Goldness, good morning, my lovely gold. Not not very good day of the day, is it? It's raining. Yes, the aristocrat. Oh, look. There's Marie. Let me hope. Oh, nice. I'm taking that out. There's the shades. Look at that gold. That sticks right out. Look at them. And they've got tiny paw prints. Look at that. Look at that one for spring. That's a lovely colour. Oh, they're beautiful. There's some nice um, autumn kind of colours right there. Well, I can see lots of makeup looks here. That looks like a... It could be a highlight. Oh, it could be a highlighter. Look at that. Smells nice. See, I like to smell my makeup. 
I'm a, something wrong with me. I like to smell things. It smells quite nice. So there's the there's the um palette. Does it tell you? 36 perfect shades. 36 perfect shades. Purr. Meow. I can't I'm trying to be a, a I'm, I'm talking to you like my mum talks to me in the morning. There, that's better. Meow. <laughs> 36 perfect shades of matte and metallic shadows to make your eyes sparkle like sapphires. Liana, good morning to you. Good morning. I'm glad you caught me. There's my lovely wee neighbour, Rafi girl. Good morning. I hope you're doing good. Yeah, no sun. It was raining there when I went out to get the post. So I'm looking forward to putting this one he's on Saturday. That's going to be fun. And of course, I'll be putting it on myself. I won't be touching it until Saturday. So, so I got that. Oh, I'll just pick things up as they're here. Look at this. <laughs> so it's a little brush. It's a little brush. It's um, por, por, perfect. Perfect. How do you pronounce that? Perfect, perfect, perfect. I would just, they should have just said per perfect, perfect. <laughs> yes, Jack, I do it as well. I, um, I smell all the, the shampoo, conditioner, fabric softener, everything like that. I've got it. It's got, it's got to do the sniff test. <laughs> Milo, good morning. Is it still morning? Good morning to you. Ah, uh, are you, Rafi girl? It's not very nice, do you? Tell you that. So I probably I won't be out. I won't, won't be out in my chair today. I've been away my swimming this morning, and I'm I'm feeling tired. I think I'll be having an early night. I thoroughly enjoyed it. There was no naked lady there today, which is always oh, is that's a bonus. <laughs> I was a wee bit nervous at first, though. I don't know what was wrong with me. I was a wee bit nervous going up first thing this morning. Don't, I don't know if it's because I'm becoming a recluse. Good morning, so Sonia. I'm struggling with a makeup brush here. Try, there we go. Good morning, lovely Sonia. Good morning. Right, I'm going to brushes. Be prepared. Hey, look at this head offer. I nearly said the bad word. Oh, and it's soft as... Look at that. My God. <laughs> look at this. You're getting it now. Be prepared. <laughs> oh my god, it's so cute and fluffy. Look at this. I had to get it. I had to get it. There you are getting pawed. Gently pawed. And it's soft as anything. I, c I don't think I can use this though. I don't know many things I've got that I can't use. See anything that's got a face? Can't use it. See anything like this? I probably can't use this. This will be for use. This will be for use. Is Pip sunburnt? Is Pip sunburnt? See, I'm missing, missing things, missing things. Oh, yes. I sit in the shade. That's what I do. I sit in the shade. Yes, Sky, every day apart from Saturday and Sunday. Uh, it is, it's so fluffy. It's, it's like a paw. I'm going to paw you. You'll be getting that on Saturday as well. Right, what's next, what's next, is this. Look at me. Look at this, it's a wee mirror. Um, it's, it's like Christmas. It's like Christmas. Good morning, Jen. Jen, I, was, I showed the palette, the Aristocats palette. And then look at the wee brush. It's got, it's like a paw. Oh, is it a, I don't, well, there you go, Pip. I had no idea it was a bank holiday. I had no idea. I hate them doing this. I'm just ripping into things now. I'm, I'm not even saving boxes anymore. I'm just ripping it. There, I got ripped. Good. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's soft. Where's it? Oh, look. There you are, look. It's a little mirror and you can check out. Oh, and that's a magnifying side. That's what I need to magnify stuff. Isn't that cute? Look at that little little mirror in the shape of a paw. 
Does it get protector on it? No, it's not got protector on it. It's just a wee bit dirty looking. I'll clean that. <laughs> huh. Right, next is this. Is, um, what one's this? Highlighter. What colour is this though? I've got all the highlighters. This is... Um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't... Oh, Pip, it was wonderful. I felt like a, a majestic mermaid or something like that. Floating. I was I was starfishing in the jacuzzi. I had to. I was like promoting me like that. And I was like, oh, this is great. Like that. And then I like to lie on my belly and put my, my arms on the, the side of the jacuzzi and look out. And you're looking out over the hills. So I'm just like that. Oh, and then I looked and the pool was quite crowded and I thought, I'm going to go in there and get nudge folk out the road and get a wee bit of your space. So it was at the very end of the pool, but that didn't matter. And it was, and it was one time, oh, it was so good. Right, so like this, oh, beautiful container. This one's called Duchess. Look at that. See when I've got my false nails on, this will be nice to tap on. Oh. That's like a champagne colour. Oh, see, I love their formula, um, Revolution. Sometimes their formula is just so beautiful and creamy. And this is one of them. I can't even... Look, it's not even powdery. It's like cream when you put it on. Look at that. Number one. I've got a problem. Waiting on my Sophie phone and she's all packed in the hospital. She's got her feeding tube out, guys. She got her feeding tube out today. She sent me a picture going, wait till you see me, Mum, and the feeding tube's gone. So she's she's eating now, so isn't that wonderful? So that's, well, this is coming up six weeks since she, she was in. So that's the feeding tube out. Today she goes to, her, um, to the rehab and she's really looking forward to it. I'm looking for, I'm wanting a tour of the place. It looks, it looks as swanky as the word. Remember, I put the S in front of that. Swanky, which just means it, was, it looks really good. So, I'm desperate to see in there. Is, thank you, go, thank you, everybody. That's, listen, that's where all you wishing me well and w wishing, praying and all the rest of it. I believe it's all, it's so definitely helped. Five weeks ago, we thought we were losing her. And now, what, what one's this? What one's this? Beloved, beloved. This one. Oh, this is a kind of. There's the the first one. This one you see, it's a kind of. Is it rosy? It was ivory. I would call it maybe an ivory kind of color. This one. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So she's going to the. You want to see the place? It's got a a a, like a five star restaurant. It's got a beautiful restaurant and all this kind of stuff. And she'll have a room of her own and she's got an ensuite bathroom. And um, I'm sure every single day they'll have things for her to do. There'll be activities every day. So I'm desperate for a tour. I can't wait for her to tour me about this place. So so that's what she's doing this morning. She's getting all her stuff packed. Is that the two for there? Right, and I've got a name that are right, okay. And then I've got this. This is um this is lip gloss. Ooh la la! <laughs> Look at this here. I mean, my God, it's so cute. This is Toulouse. Toulouse. I hope I'm saying his name right. Toulouse. Thank you, Jagla. Thank you, Al. Thank you, everybody. It is. It's amazing because she's had that feeding tube in now for five weeks. Oh, thank you, Jen, and welcome to the chat. Let's have a, ooh, that's a lovely colour. Look, I'm not even showing these that now. Look. Mmm. It tastes, it tastes like cake. <laughs> I'll be me sitting here today like that. <laughs> it tastes like cake. That's too loose. Thank you, Pip. Yes, it's amazing. And I was, as I said, I was talking to the psychiatrist the other night and I was 
saying to them, thank you so much, because they saved her life. And uh, she said, oh, we didn't save her life, but it was the staff at the hospital. I says, but you got her into the Priory, because that's, 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 that's a right fancy place. I'm hoping she meets a footballer or something like that in there, you know what I mean? Right, here's the second package. I'll tell you. Milo, I bet you she's loving it that she's got that out because, see, when I was talking to her, she'd be going, oh, it's, it's annoying me, this, and my, my nose. Um, Sky, I've no shame. I'm starting to eat the makeup. <laughs> right, well, I'm just ripping that. It's stuck now. Right. So the next one is another highlighter because, you know, two is not enough. I had to get, I had to get more. Mill, good morning to you. Good morning. Thank you for the blueberries. I do love my blueberries. Right, this one is Madame. This one is Madame. Oh, this is a darker one. Look. There's the three highlighters. So let's have a wee look at this one. Oh, that could almost be a blusher. See, it's like rosy colour. Oh, I like that one. I think actually that would be my favourite one. Oh, yes, yeah, see, I love all that, all the, all the old stuff as well. I love all that kind of thing as well. <laughs> that figure. Sometimes, sometimes YouTube's like that. You've got to refresh. So I've got that. I've still got, oh no, I've got, I've got everything. Um, this one is, what is this one? Berlo's, Berlo's. How do you pronounce that? Berlo's. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I'll need to look it up before I'm doing my makeup videos with it because I'll look like I'll look as stupid as I am. Oh, look at this one. This is a see-through one. Oh, oh, it does. It smells like cake. Oh, it smells like cake. See, it's just like a gloss that one. And uh, do you know I'm going to need to, I'm going to need to double. I'm going to need to double glass it. I'm going to need to. <laughs> right, what are these scented with? Or flavoured with? And I still can't read that writing. My God, you need a magnifying glass. The taste of something anyway. Do that. <laughs> the taste of something. Something nice. Right, so there's that one. Then there's this one. This one's Marie. Ooh, oh, I like this one. This is like a silver one. This, that was with my radiotherapy. My radiotherapy done that to me. That was the side that I got zapped. Zap, zap. That's what that's with. Oh, see, they smell really good. See, it's got a kind of white shimmer. Love, oh, see, I'm loving it all. And lastly, another thing that will never be used. Because <laughs> it's too cute. The eyelashes. Look how cute they are. So there you are. There's my wee hole. That's my hole. <laughs> I'm a terrible pair. Now I need to go and find room for all of this stuff. No, listen, Wrath Girl, I don't mind people asking. That's that's perfectly okay. I, you know, I like questions are welcome. I like people ask me stuff. What one? See, I'm missing all the chat. Wait a minute. I'll close all this makeup and then I'll... You know. Have a look back at the chat because I'm missing everything. I'm missing everything. Yeah, do you know what, Rafi girl? I've even got I've got a wee tattoo. As if I've not got enough tattoos, but they said to me when I was getting, uh, you can't really see it there. 
radiotherapy. Do you mind if we give you a tattoo? <laughs> no, I was thinking, well, I've always, I've always wanted the NASA sign. You could tattoo me that. But it's just right here and it's a wee tattooed dot. And that tattooed dot um, lined me up in the, the radiotherapy machine. So everybody gets it, this wee dot on them so they can um, get you up like that. And I to have my arms up, like, which is quite difficult for me, but I had to do that lie like that and get zapped. It doesn't take long to get radiotherapy. It's not like chemo. Chemo takes over an hour to go through you. Oh, that's so right, Rafika. I don't, as I say, I don't mind. I don't mind people asking me things, and you're not rude at all. Right, let me see the chat. What's got, I'm missing out here. I'm missing out. <laughs> oh, thank you, the baby. Thank you very much. There's Mr. Making Poppy kicking off. Sky, what did Sky say? Oh, the vintage shops, yes, the vintage shops. Oh, Mikey! Do you hear this? This is what I get every day, every day. I like going around charity shops. I say, my, Mikey, my giraffe there, him, he was in a, a charity shop, one of a kind, he has, his name's Jeffrey. So original, I know, but that's his name. And um, he was made in Rwanda, so he was, and he was in a charity shop. And I went to the charity shop, I was, still, I was in my wheelchair at the time, because I'd just got the operation. And the charity shop, I had no money, right? And I saw this, and I thought, I'm going to need to get money and go up the next day and get them. And I went up the next day, and they didn't open till 10 o'clock, and I was up at 9. And other people started coming to the charity shop, and I'm thinking... They're after the giraffe, that's what they're in for. They're going to, and I'm saying to my son, see, as soon as the door's open, I'm going and grab the giraffe. I'm going and grab the giraffe. <laughs> see, the thing about it now, nobody was looking at the giraffe apart from me. But I was like, that's what they're, they're going to try and go and snatch the giraffe. Go and get it, Peter. <laughs> as soon as the door's open, he was in, get the giraffe. <laughs> Yeah, there was a wee place it uh, uh, was going up to Edinburgh. What was the name? Um, okay, it began by an L. It's on the way to Edinburgh, and it's a wee seaside kind of village thing. And I always remember um, going in there with my brother and his wife, and it was a wee antique shop, and it was beautiful. Of course, I was skint, so I couldn't buy anything. But it had lovely stuff, and it had a lot of like, witchcrafty kind of things, you know, like, like spell books and cloaks and all that kind of stuff, magical things. And I was like, oh God, I'd be buying all that. I'd, I'd, be, I'd be having a cloak on on a Saturday with a wee bit of flavouring. Oh, is that you getting milk? Good night, lovely Mills. Thank you so much for coming in. And sweet dreams, sweet dreams. I can't wait for the Olympics. As I say, I love the Olympics. I love the Summer Olympics, the Winter Olympics, and I love the Paralympics as well because I know how hard it is for someone that's not physically able to do things. But it doesn't mean that we're, we're for the broth pot as people are for the, the bin. You know, we still can do stuff. So I, I get inspired when I see these um, the Paralympians, you know, doing great things. The curling, I love the curling, and you can get wheelchair curling. Can you imagine me? A wheelchair curl. I, I'd be, I'd be playing dodgems. <laughs> I'd be ramming folk down in my wheelchair. Get out the roads. No, that's my stone. Get your own stone. That's mine. Ramming folk down nice. I'd get tossed out. Would. I'd get thrown out. <laughs> skidding, 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 that, skidding on the ice. Shh, like that. <laughs> That'd be wonderful. I'd like, I'd like to have a shot of that. The curling. Yeah, Edinburgh, Edinburgh is, see that the old street in Edinburgh, it is very, very, it's, it takes you back in time, it's all cobbled, it's all cobbled street, but it's all in hills, I don't think I could tackle Edinburgh now, <laughs> like the, the hills, but 
every every memory of it. I've been like my works my works day out when I was sixteen, and we ended up um, getting a drink and lying down for Edinburgh Castle on benches and things like that. <laughs> drink. Oh, getting back in the bus, absolutely. Saying that the teachers they were they were um, they were all drunk as well, so nobody noticed. Look at me in my double glasses. This is what I do every day. <laughs> Uh, sometimes I'm going about this and going, where's my glasses? And I've got two pairs on. Edinburgh is beautiful. It's a bit more pricey than Glasgow, though. It's a bit more pricey, I would say, than Glasgow. I know the, the, the cobbles are quite... But do you know some gold does? I prefer Stirling Castle. I know that people are going to say that I'm crazy, but I like... There's just something about Stirling Castle that I really, really like. Edinburgh Castle is beautiful, don't get me wrong. Edinburgh Castle is gorgeous. But there's just something about Stirling Castle that I really love. And then Wallace's Monument right at the side of it. And when I go to get my car, that's that's I go out to Stirling to get, to get my car. So it's a beautiful, beautiful place. Angie, good morning, my lovely Angie. I hope you're doing good. <laughs> How do you pronounce your name? X Patrick. I've got squishy, squishy time. I've got a squishy bottle here. Oh, yes, yes. Squishy. There, squished. See, they don't even bother now with the squishy. I still squish them though. <laughs> Grey Friars. I've never been to Grey Friars. Um, ex Padre, yes, for the broth, pro, bo, broth pot, it just means you're useless. <laughs> you know, I go, oh, that's me, I'm for the broth pot now. That's it, I'm for the broth pot. You could make a, a good broth out of me, right enough, there's a lot of fat on the bones. <laughs> a big pot of blueberry soup. I've never been to Greyfriars, but I know about Greyfriars Bobby, and if you don't know, it's a wee dog, it was a wee Scottish Terrier, and this wee dog, um, his owner died, it's a tragic story, the wee, wee Greyfriars Bobby, his owner died, and someone else took the dog, and they buried the, pair, the man, and the wee dog used to go every day and lie on its owner's grave, and then at night go home, and then every day go back and lie on its own. It was a terrible tragic story, but they've got a wee they've got a wee statue, I'm sure, of the wee dog. But that's sad. And that's sad that's a sad affair that <laughs> Sky <laughs> Welcome to Scotland where we know everything's fair game here. <laughs> yeah, the the wee dog oh Oh, see anything that dogs get killed, I, I can't watch it. Can't. I can watch serial killer things, right? I can watch that, no bother. I can watch horror movies, and people get like Nightmare on Elm Street. I can watch all that, but see if something's in it that a dog dies, that's it. I'm disturbed forever. Don't be showing me films with dogs dying. <laughs> it's like the one with Will Smith. I love that film too. Um. Oh, the one that is like a, a zombie apocalypse, that one. And it's only him and he's in New York and he's got his wee dog called Sam. Right, the whole movie you're thinking this wee dog is a boy dog, I don't know why. And he's going, come on Sam and everything, come on Sam. And Sam gets bit by a zombie. And Will Smith has got to kill the dog. And you find out it was Samantha was the name of the dog. It was a wee girl dog. And he was crying while he was killing a dog. I was like, turn it over immediately. Turn it off. There's a dog dying in the telly. Turn it off. Can't do it. I would watch that film again, but I can't because of the whole dog dying. Mm-mm. Marley and me, I've never watched it because I know it's meant to be bad. Hayley, good morning, my lovely Hayley. Is it morning? It's afternoon. Good afternoon, Hayley. I'm still in morning time. <laughs> That's this guy, I Am Legend. Brilliant film. Dog dies. I can't watch it. I'm not watching it. Mm -mm. Nope. 
Well, I don't why is that. I can watch things about humans dying. No bother at all. <laughs> Phil, if there's a dog dying, that's it. I can't watch it. No chance. Be showing me films with dogs dying. Hmm. My, do you know my my kids are the same? So maybe it's just us. <laughs> Maybe it's just, maybe it's just us. Saying that, I probably get on with dogs a lot more than I get on with a lot of humans. A lot of people think I'm weird. Well, maybe they're right, you know, I might be right. But Minx Laura always says this and it's true, weird is good. Weird is, uh, I'm, a, I'm a weirdo. <laughs> See, but I can admit it, I can put my hand up and say, yes, that'll be me you're looking for. Is there any weirdos in here? Well, I suppose I'm one, yes. I'm, I'm quite weird. <laughs> uh, I eat makeup and I sit and lick lipstick. <laughs> I sit like that during the day and watch films. <laughs> it smells. It does. It smells like cake. Is it or vanilla? They've got something in the formula of this anyway. If you like cake and stuff, I'll tell you, your significant other would want to be kissing you if you wore this. Look out, Aquaman. See, if I, I see Aquaman coming up my, my path, this is going on me like a shot. And I'll be saying to him, do you know what, Aquaman, I've been talking to my friends on YouTube and we don't know what this is scented. Could you have a wee try at this and see what it, what, what, what it tastes like? I'll be like that to him. <laughs> <laughs> And he'll run away, and I'll be trying to chase him. Like, oh, come back! Someone snag him, throw throw a net over that man. Catch him, he's mine. <laughs> Get in the house, lock the doors, key. Of course, the key would come flying out, there's nothing there to hold it. But it's a good day today. I went my swimming, as I said. Do you know, I've got another problem. Pots, planting stuff. On my Facebook, did you see, your see if you didn't see, I need to show you. I've bought more pots to do planting. See, since things have started to grow, I've got a wee kick out here. I thought, oh, look what I can do. I can do. I'm bringing life to the world. And it's not through my vajayjay. Hehehehe. <laughs> It's not as sore bringing this leaf to the world. Wait, I'll show you this leaf that I'm, I'm making. Look. Look! Can you see it? Look at that. Plants. That's wild flowers. That's wild, wild flowers in that one. Right, now I see I've got that much stuff around about me. I need to tidy up my area. I need to tidy your area up. <laughs> For God's sake. Right, now I've, now I've lost you, so there we are. Found you now. Found you. Yeah, see, I, I'll tell you a film, Rafi Girl, that's really it's sad, but it's a great, great film phenomenon with John Travolta. See, I've got a wee thing about John Travolta as well. And it's a fantastic film. But see, now I've ruined the end because you know he dies in it, because I said that. And um, I've watched that numerous times, but I always cry at the end. I always cry, but it's a great, great film. <laughs> Sky, I know I'm a bit wild myself. I think it's been the big kick up the swimming, you know. Babe? No Naked Lady, which was a bonus. That was good. We were all that happy. Me and all the wee people that I usually see in the morning. We had a wee smile on. Oh, it's great to be back. We were all at that buzzing to get in to get, do my lengths in the pool. It was wonderful. It was wonderful. Yeah, so I've bought eight pots, eight, that I'm going to put right here under my windows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight along there. And I'm going to have yellow flowers, white flowers, blue flowers and red flowers. Like that. I'm going to have them along there. Hopefully they won't get stole. <laughs> <laughs> like my candy canes. I put candy canes all around there and somebody stole them. But they, do you know the, wor the worst thing was they didn't steal them for, here I'm taking that home from my garden. They took them over the road there and smashed them into smithereens. Take the candy canes out that lady's garden, smash them up. That's what they done. I don't think they'll be doing that with plants though. What kind of, what kind of sick person would do that with a pot of plants? Anyway, it's not as if they're that expensive. It's just a... 
some cheap pots with some seeds I'm going to plant in and then I can go out there and water every day and bring more life into the world. I, I, I've got a wee kick out of watching them sprout and every day I'm going, I'm saying to Peter, oh, come and see. <laughs> They're like that, some of them are like that now. Oh. Yeah, Phenomenon Golfer Girl, it's a wonderful film. Wonder and John Travolta, oh, he's good, he's good, isn't it? But it's, it's, it's sad, very sad. And do you know what other one? The Green Mile. Who doesn't cry at the Green Mile? I know, I love Tom Hanks. He does, he, I'm as well writing a list of people I don't fancy. Because <laughs> I like Tom Hanks as well. There's a theme happening here. And uh, the Green Mile is fantastic. What a film the Green Mile is, but that's a, that's a heartbreaker as well. Heartbreaking film. Yes, it's, oh, it's lunchtime. See, I'm on a bit later because I knew I was getting these delivered and I wanted to come on and unbox them. But look at it. I mean, my, I can't. How can you use that? How could I make that dirty? That's yours. I'm going to use this on you. This is what you are going to get on Saturday. Pod. And the wee, where's the wee thing? See, I've lost everything now. Things disappear round about me. God knows where I went to. There's a wee mirror somewhere. Hopefully I don't stand on it and break it. So, the colours of flowers, I'm just going to have all white in one pot, all yellow in one pot, all blue in one pot, like that. And it should be nice if it, if it works. Hopefully the work, I, I'll, as I say, I'll get a week. See, when they start sprouting, I'll be like, oh, look. I'm creating life. I'm doing my bit for planet Earth. I'm doing my bit for bees. And I'll tell you, see, the past few days I've been sitting out there and I've been really, you'd be proud of me. You would be proud. <laughs> Big, massive bees. And I'm sitting going, don't run away from it. It's your friend. Bees, your friend. Bees are friends, not food. <laughs> bees are friends. And it's going, Nye! like that. And I'm going, oh, bees are friends. Bees are friends. And then it flies away. So I've been, I've been quite brave. If it was a wasp, it'd have been getting batted by the zapper. <laughs> Sneezana, good afternoon to you. Good afternoon, good afternoon. Ah, uh, nap time. Oh, that'll be your time then, Rafi girl. Get a wee cup of coffee or a wee, a wee snooze for half an hour. Oh, do I smell? There you go, Randy. See? <laughs> this is just... A, I've, sometimes I've got a double glass at Do I like Axe Rose? I don't know who that is. See, I'm an old lady. Is that is a new person? Or Axel Rose for the, the the rocker. What was he in? I do like a bit of rock music if it's that. If it's Axel Rose, I do like a bit of rock. I like all sorts of music. So I do. I'm a bit of a raver though. See, at heart, I'm, I like my rave music. I still do. Yeah, Guns N' Roses, that's who it's in. I like a bit of Guns N' Roses. But I'm a raver. I'm a raver, baby. So why don't you call me? That's a song. Oh, ho, ho, ha, 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 I'm a raver, baby. Why don't you call me? And then he goes, dum, 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 like that. <laughs> I don't, I don't fancy, that's someone that's on my note. Fancying as Boris Johnson. I, I, I don't fancy that man. No. Do you know who I like though? Terry Crews. I like a bit. Oh, I wouldn't mind a bit of Terry Crews. <laughs> See, I like, I, I like a variety. I like all shapes, sizes, colours, religions. You know, I like I like a bit of everything here. <laughs> Pip, I know, right? See, I should be on Simon Cowbell. Like, he'd be like, go button her immediately. Give her the go button. See if I was on stage, I'd have my wheelchair though and I'd be doing tricks. But while I was singing, I'd be doing wheelies and stuff, or, or I could take the rocking chair on and show them show them that because that's a talent I've got for that rocking that rocking chair. I can bring that chair so it's just a wee bit like that more, and I'd be back like that. 
Oh, t- uh, Teddy Cruz. <whistles> <laughs> so Simon Cowell be like, just, just, if, if, even before I started singing, be like, she's a winner, are there? <laughs> that wee old lady there, she's, she's, she's up. <laughs> uh, well, see, you've got to have a dream. I've got, I have a lot of dreams. That'll probably never come true. But you listen, see when I close my eyes at night. Some, some, well, I've told you, some of my dreams are banging, as we say. <laughs> some, of, some of my dreams are fantastic. But they never go all the My dreams don't ever go all the way. My dreams go a week. Like, the Celtic team, I was like, they were like, do you want a wee kiss and a cuddle? I was like, yes, please. And I kissed and cuddled it, Scott Brown and then Eduardo. I gave, gave him a wee kiss and cuddled. I was going to go through the whole the whole lot of them. The whole including the substitutes. I'd kissed and cuddled them too. <laughs> and then I thought to myself, there's a name for girls like me, isn't there? That just would kiss him day. <laughs> see, my age though, that'd be a compliment. See if so <laughs> see if someone called me the S word. You know, that that goes with a lot of guys. That'd be a bit of a compliment. I'd be like, that's that's nice of you, thanks very much. That's an accomplishment in my age. <sighs> oh, Sky had terrible nightmares. Oh, Sky, I hope you have good dreams tonight, Sky. Watch something. See, before you go to your bed, watch Aquaman. Aquaman, watch. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just saying. See if he was here, though, he's mine, right? See if he goes on the cruise with us. Uh, I licked him, so he's mine. <laughs> Use Candy Touch. Right, so so I'm having Aquaman. You can have some whoever you want, right? But right, that's what we'll need to we'll need to have boundaries here for this cruise. <laughs> you can look. Mm-hmm. Oh. So we'll all have our assigned pe- people that you're not allowed to touch. Right, that one's I'm having him. That one's mine. <laughs> uh. I've told my mum about the cruise. I think she wants to come, but she would ruin it for me. See if my mum came on the cruise, I couldn't I couldn't be myself. <laughs> oh well, Sky, well there you go. I I've I've read everything on him, Ted Bundy. I've watched everything and, and read everything about the man. Because I was interested in, in trying to get into his brain. Because he was he was an intelligent man. He was he was a upcoming lawyer and all this, you know. He was like somebody you would never think in your life that would be a maniac serial killer. And some of the ways that he snatched these victims. I mean, putting a cast on and saying, "Oh, here I can get into my car. Can you help me?" And somebody coming over and just pushing them in the car and driving away. I'll note that down for how to abduct Aquaman. <laughs> Put some fish in the car. Ask Aquaman if he can help. Give fish resuscitation. Shove him in. Lock door. Job done. Drive. <laughs> I'm going to have a book like that. That'd be a great book. That'd be some reading. See, for years to come, if somebody found a book like that that I wrote, they'd be like, this lady had some serious issues. Yeah. Yes, Angie, see, that was the thing. A lot of serial killers, you just look at them like, um, well, not even a serial killer, like, uh, what's her name? St- Stephanie Lazarus, right? You look at her, she was a cop. She was um, a cop that murdered this this lady, that, that a love rival. And you just look at her and you go like that. She's a murderer. It's just, just got the looky one. Her eyes are, like, staring out her head, you can tell. Jodie Arias, right? Look into her eyes as well. She's got the same look. She's got the look of the devil. Right, so some of them you can you spot, but Ted Bundy, nobody would have ever thought that he was, he was like a, an outstanding citizen. That, you know, people go, oh, he's a lovely young gentleman, him right there. <whistles> stuff, that is the stuff. Don't be watching that sky at night time. I'm telling you, get some John Travolta or Aquaman. Get grease on. <laughs> Yes, I've watched. I've watched all the the movies and stuff like that. See, that's what I, I love. I love watching serial killer things, serial killer documentaries. I, I I love watching all of that. 
I think I've watched them all. The Green River Killer and um, what's his name? John Wayne Gacy. He was the the clown that had all the the guys buried in his crawl space. Um, so I don't Zach Efron is that? I don't know if I have seen that one then. Maybe if not, I'm going to look for it because I've got Netflix. I'm going to have a look. Um, but even I watched how he got executed and all that Ted Bundy. But and then he, before he got executed, they had a priest or someone in um, saying that it was because he was reading naughty books that he was a serial killer. But listen, before I had a wee swatch through some naughty books, it's not made us go out there and want to kill folk, is it really? No, I don't know him, Sneezana. Sneez I'll need to watch that. I've don't, I don't think I have seen that then, Angie. Um, and Haley, I'll need to watch that because that's something I'm really interested in, all that kind of stuff. But I'll see if you don't know this guy. This is one for you to watch the day, right? You can find his whole court case on Law and Crime channel that's on YouTube. And, um, oh God, what's the boy's name? Oh, my mind's went blooming blank. That many serial killers swirling around my head. Joe Guys, that's his name. Joe Guy Jr. I'm going to show you some. This guy. Again, you just need to look at this guy. <laughs> right, you may see his face. You just need to look at this guy here. Right, and you're thinking to yourself. Yeah, him and Chris Watts was one that you would, wouldn't have thought, but um, Joe Guy, have a look, have a look at that trial. Um, that's the the boy that planned out and committed his parents' murder, but he had uh, he had a uh, um, diary that he wrote step by step what he was going to do, and he done it step by step. So he had a diary, so he was planning all this out. You know, kill n number one, kill dad. Number two, cut dad up. Number three, put dad in container. Number four, kill mum. The same. And then in the next page, it was dad's assets. Bought $100,000. Two cars, $25,000. Um, and they, they, the whole thing mapped out. And then he had meat grinder, right? A shudder. A shudder. In his car, they found a meat grinder, an industrial meat grinder, they found in the man's car. So, on this, see if he's watching this today, it's, it's chilling. So, a lot of you, it's probably a trigger warning. A lot of you probably won't be able to watch it. But the police have got the body cam thing on, right? So, she go, she, she's sent to the house and she's like this. We're in the house and there's a pot on the stove. And there's something cooking in the pot. Something cook. They don't know yet what's in the pot. That's a that is a that is a terrible surprise when you find out what was in the pot on the stove. Terrible. <laughs> I said to Peter, I said to Peter, darling, gonna know ever boil my head in the stove. He said, Mum, for Jesus Christ, no, it would be boiling your head. I said, just checking, son, just checking. You never know. Terrible. And he watched the whole trial like that. He was like that in the courtroom. And the autopsy pictures came up and he was looking at them like that. As if well I'd done good there. That was a good job I'd done right there. That was good. That's 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 one that you're hoping the guy gets a tanking, as we say when he gets inside. He needs a right good tanking. Do you know what he needs? We carry, we carry for Kilmarnock, for, Gl for Glasgow Kilmarnock. He needs her to be barging into the cell. She was the one that barged into that lassie cell in Cortonville. Gave her a tanking because she was, she battered up, she battered a, a wee granny. Take, put her in there, put her in Joe Guise's prison. She'll go and do it. And then see when they say, did you beat him up? She'll go, not guilty. Like, even though there's cameras on her, not guilty. Not guilty at all. 
Angie, there's something no right about the guy, but he's one that you're looking at him and you're thinking, that guy's this, that guy's a, a murderer. Whereas Chris Watts, looking at him, you'd have never thought that man would have been doing anything like that. And he done, I would say, even worse than Joe Guys because he, he murdered his children. Put them in oil tanks. All because he was getting a wee bit... It was, it was his head. I don't even know how to say it. A bit in the sides, but oh. and we've got to refer to her as NK because I don't know why our lawyers were going crazy because people were talking about her on YouTube. So people that are talking about her have got to refer to her as NK. Some people are referring to her as North Korea. I know that um, Molly Go Lightly she calls her that. So we're we're not. There's a lot of things we're not allowed to talk about now. <laughs> I like to talk about what I want to talk about, but we're, we're, we're slapped down a bit now. We've got to behave ourselves. It's difficult for me. It's difficult. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm going to go and look for somewhere to put all this makeup. But I'll be putting it on using Saturday. But I'll never use this on myself. I could never dip that into... How could you dip that into stuff? It's so beautiful. So it's just going to be used for use so soft and that will sound nice on the camera when I'm brushing the camera I could never use that so cute so anyway have a wonderful day everybody I'll, um, oh yes Scott Peterson I know he was he was another one but Joe Guys is that guy have a wee look at that everybody that oh, that's an eye opener that one Um, I'm going to try and find that Ted Bundy thing on Netflix now because I've watched that Ted Bundy I think so this stuff I'll be back again tomorrow and I love you all very much. Thank you for coming in. I'm going to give you a big schmackaroonie. Ready? Mm -hmm. Did you taste it? Cake. <laughs> Bye, everyone.